We've got some creek levels to talk about. Old Creek, creek you've got a warning until Thursday evening. Black Creek, you've got a warning until Friday afternoon. Tonawanda, we're still dealing with it. I'm gonna start at Batavia's. Yours is until Thursday morning and at Rapids Friday afternoon until further notice. Temperatures wise, we're in the teens to the 20s. Those winds coming out of the north, kind of breezy, making it feel like what to the single digits to the teens. Oh, it's quite cold out there. Those snow showers are slowly starting to back off. Overnight, it'll be cloudy. It'll be cold. Those are rent lows will be in the teens with a few flurries. Don't be surprised, especially off the Lake Ontario shoreline. Let's get into that super seven day where we go in depth for you. Thursday is looking kind of nice and quiet, but we've got a system coming on the way. Clouds open up and then they come back. You see those snow showers making their way slowly from the southern tier. We get a few hours of that wintry mix around the New York Pennsylvania line. My main concern with that, slick roads. And then you get a little bit of a dry spot. We get another shot of snow. Friday night, things quiet down. Let's see how much snow we're looking at from this large scale system here. From the evening to the morning time, you'll see anywhere between three to almost six inches. Then as you head throughout the rest of the period, you'll be seeing anywhere between six to eight inches. You see how they're locally higher around the hilltops and a little bit of that lake enhancement off the Lake Ontario shoreline. Now let's get into the rest of that seven day. It's going to be breezy on Saturday with those temperatures. In the 20s we get a shot of snow again with those temps in the 30s for your Sunday going into Monday another day in the 20s but at least you'll see a mix of sun and clouds Tuesday those temperatures will be in the 30s and going into the rest of that seven day we continue to be in the 